oldies but goodies. These are some old packs I found for sale in a shop on my travels. Um, they were for sale for a dollar each, and a couple of them were uh, two, uh, three for two. So um, I want to do a quick PSA also for these old packs. I don't know, a lot of people buy these. These are all available online and stuff like that. Uh, you can get them. Um, there's actually a couple of people selling them by the pound. <laughs> Uh, you could buy them by the pound, or um, uh, you could buy them in lots of a thousand cards, or you know, ten packs, you know, uh, weird stuff like that. Um, the PSA portion is, um, I just wanted to tell you folks that uh, when you see something like this, all these old packs, they've been searched already. I don't care what anybody says, they've been searched. Even if you buy a sealed box, an old box, I mean, unless it's a reputable dealer, and I'm talking about really reputable. You're not going to find these that have not been searched. Um, I'll just do a quick vid. Uh, now, uh, like I said, I was staying this over at somebody's house, and you know, for a couple days, and uh, they opened up a few of these already. This is uh, Upper Deck uh, 2001, um, and uh, one of the comments was, "They're like, I don't recognize any of these players." <laughs> like, look at this. Two top prospects next to each other. <laughs> the same exact card. Uh, some kind of insert here. Stolen base leaders. Loop rocks, one of those. Here's a Cincinnati Reds a hologram card. It's pretty nice. Too bad you can't see it. He said, well, here's a, actually Sammy Sosa, who's a White, White Sox. A lot of people don't realize that. Which is good for me. For my PC. But he's like, you know, I don't know who any of these people are. Greg Olson, I mean, he's a football player now. <laughs> no, um, yeah, he said, you know, he made a comment. It's like, I don't know any, you know, I never heard of these guys. And uh, I told him, I said, yeah, because they take out all the good cards. This is, uh, 1990 upper deck. Uh, here's a tinier hologram. This one is uh, Rangers. You probably can't see it. This one you can't. I can't even see. It's like hard to see. A Yankee for my PC, but, you know, who the hell is he? <laughs> this is a, a checklist Orioles. Yeah, like I said, these have all been searched. I don't care where you get them from. They're going to be uh, resealed. And uh, this is going to be... Uh, no, I already did that one. Sorry. Uh, score. This is from uh, 1991 Score. Andy Hawkins, Yankees for my PC, but who the hell is he? Here's a rookie prospect. Here's a Yankee, a first round uh, draft pick. Here's actually Ozzie Guillen. Master Blaster, Kevin Mitchell. Anybody know who he is? He's a Master Blaster. And here's something World Series trivia card. With the hologram for 1912. Yeah, all these, like I said, uh, PSA wise, uh, I'm gonna do some of these non PSA wise. I'm gonna, you know, try to fit a few in this uh, PSA here, but just to show you, all the good stuff has been uh, plucked already. These have been searched. This is a Leaf, a 2002 Series 1. And it's like most of these guys, you know. There's actually uh, Norm Carlton, some kind of insert, gold edition, I guess. And you can see there's actually, I don't know if you could see it in there, there's actually some kind of a print there, leaf. Uh, it actually says leaf in there, like a watermark right there.
But like I said, all the good players have been plucked already. I uh, never saw this one before. This is called Line Drive at AA Baseball Pre Rookie 91. Opening these live on camera. But like I said, these have been searched already. You're not going to find anything good in here. I mean, it could be wrong, but odds are I'm not. Like I said, uh, now some um, you know some places are selling these for a lot more than a dollar. So that's another thing you gotta be careful of. These have been searched. Doesn't matter if you look on eBay, they're gonna this is eighty nine score. Um, you know they're gonna say, oh, what's you know all the great stars you can get out of there. All you gotta do is look in a magazine, you know, sword collector thing. Look right in the baseball, and they're gonna have you know some of the old packs. Some of them even have prices for the old packs and. Uh, uh, the uh, old boxes and stuff like that. See, like a 202 right here. It's a 202 Bowman Best. 202 uh, Bowman Best. Uh, a pack of five cards is 20 bucks, and a box is $180. Ten packs. So, there you go. Lucky if you find a sealed box. Well, here's Fernando Venezuela. Remember him from the Dodgers? Here's 89 rookie. Geronimo! Another rookie. So two rookies out of there. Like I said, all the good stuff has been fucked. Here's a 92 score. Now these shop, this shop I got these from had uh, like thousands of them. Uh, I only bought the cheap ones because I knew they were searched, so I wasn't going to pay too much money. Chris Nabos. Roberto Kelly, Yankee from IPC. Don't remember him though. Seeing all nobodies. I'm gonna make another video with some more packs. Uh, I just don't want to make too many, you know, one big long one. So uh, if you want to just see me busting up some of these oldies but goodies, uh, stay tuned for the next video. Thanks again, and don't forget make your own PSAs, make your own comments, and remember, always people uh, have a merry Christmas. Um, doesn't matter what your uh, religious affiliation is, just say it to uh, piss off the losers and, uh, you know, Merry New Year and, uh, or say Happy Christmas and Merry New Year. That's my alternative way of doing it. But as always, uh, dream big, people, dream big. And I would say rate the video, but you guys don't listen anyway, so it doesn't matter. Thanks anyway. Dream big. Well, I woke up today. And the world seemed a restless place